Get back to that rescue on the Lower East Side. As we speak, it appears firefighters have been able to extract the man who had been uh, partially buried in a pit. We're told it's a construction worker. Uh, moments ago, this happening. Uh, chopper 2 over the scene there. This is at 413 Grand Avenue. Dozens of firefighters on the scene. It looks like they've got him uh, secured and immobilized there on some kind of a stretcher. And uh, we're hoping for the best as, uh, as this happens. But uh, dozens of firefighters, we're not sure exactly how it happened, but he was covered in rock and dirt, at least up to his chest. So uh, one would hope that, uh, that the best outcome here mm -hmm. is, uh, is the result. And, and with any operation like this, obviously, we need to um, keep in mind how um, sensitive everything is in that area. The firefighters, as you mentioned, Maurice, having to work very gingerly, making sure that um, all of the rock and the dirt and um, whatever else is surrounding that uh, construction worker doesn't fall um, anymore and have that construction fall even deeper down into that pit. But we can tell you, there um, is some encouraging news. We have been watching the firefighters um, maintain this rescue, and the victim is now on a stretcher. You can see that they're working on him. Live pictures from Chopper 2 we're sharing with you right now. Uh, there is no word on the condition yet of this uh, construction worker, but it is a good sign that we see him um, there on the stretcher. And a couple other things you consider as uh, this goes on. 35 degrees out there. It's cold, but not as cold as it's been over the past uh, uh, few weeks or a few days and uh, furthermore the speed at which they're working they're not in uh, the ultimate rush they seem to be careful about it and they seem to have some time so those would seem to be good indicators uh, that seem to be working in his favor Joe Bierman is uh, up above in chopper two you've been watching this for quite a while now Joe and it looks like uh, we're getting a thumbs up here right Yep, it all started uh, a little after 4 o'clock. This is 413 Grand Street. We're about a block or two south of the Williamsburg Bridge, almost over to the FDR Drive. We're widen out here. There was a construction project. That worker had been trapped for almost an hour up to his waist in mud, rock, uh, debris. Now, the fire department had to come in with specialty units and dig that worker out piece by piece. They brought in what they call a special Con Ed vacuum truck to vacuum some of the dirt out. There's the hole that he was stuck in. They put the plywood around him to se secure the wall so there's no further collapse. The good news is we were listening to the fire department. They said he was alert and conscious when he was pulled from the, ac from the uh, pit there from the construction accident. Uh, no word yet on which hospital he's going to, but a dramatic rescue now over here on the Lower East Side. Live in Chopper 2, Joe Bierman, CBS 2 News. All right, Joe, thank you. As we get more developments, of course, we will keep you updated. In the meantime,